Hollywood converged on Manhattan for the premiere of the HBO miniseries Mildred Pierce at the historic Ziegfeld Theater. You, you here to work? It so happens that I've taken a job in a restaurant. As a what? As a waitress. It's a spectacular piece of writing and it's so rich and full. So it was such a luxury for us to be able to make this. You know what would be a highly original thing for you to do? Say yes right away. Just like that. You better look out. I might say yes. It's a story about people and emotions and the complex uh, way in which we relate to each other. Promise you won't tell a soul. Vita in particular. Vita, if you ask me, has some funny ideas. Well, Todd went back to the original novel on which the film was based and brought much more detail to the fore. There were just too many elements in the book that I felt hadn't been given a fair treatment and I wanted to get in there. There were things in it that felt intensely relevant and connected to what our experience is today. Facing financial crises in America right now, um, the, what it means to be a single mother, We'd both seen the film, but when he went back and read the book, he realized how much the film had left out and how different the two really were. It's very different, I'm told, to the original movie because I still haven't seen that. Deliberately, I didn't see it. With enough money, I can get away from you. It was extremely hard to have to be so cruel to Kate every day. We, we, we longed for a fun scene, but um, it was amazing. She's my favorite actress, and it was just an honor to get to do this with her. Some of the looks that I give her, I give my mom a lot. So, like the... I have to say, I'm just so impressed with Miss Winslet and her work. That's really the thing that defines it. It's a remarkable performance, and it's a remarkable feat. Ta-da! It's beautiful. It's such an honor. I mean, it really is. I mean, I just felt like the luckiest girl in town. I really did. It's great. It's beautiful, well acted. Uh, the way it's filmed, just this moment of her alone in a restaurant was like this kind of uh, moving Edward Hopper painting for a moment. The art direction was, was amazing. And, you know, of course, Kate is just, you know, she's wonderful. That's like almost exactly 10 years after Boardwalk Empire is set and just seeing how clothes uh, have morphed into something a little different. I mean, it's just, it's all fascinating. It plays really well and it's very powerful and I'm really, really happy and very, very proud and excited. You're watching HBO and you've been buzzed. You've been buzzed. You've been buzzed on HBO.